Hello everyone. I am Venerable Sopon Panya Sopano. Today, I would like to share the useful wisdom with you. It's about how to deal with the negative thoughts. There are five effective strategies to deal with our negative thoughts that I'd like to share with you today. The first strategy is letting go. Letting go is about how you disconnect yourself from the negative thought that you have in the moment. As you know that, we can have negative thoughts from time to time, which is normal for human beings, right? But once we have negative thoughts, just recognize it that it's not good for our life. We shouldn't deserve to have negative thoughts that will ruin our life. Instead, just let it go. That will help the mind to have more space to fit in with positive things. Strategy number two: embracing the positive affirmations. Positive affirmations or the mantra can help the mind to turn from the negative one to the positive one. With the positive affirmations, it could be the words that you like that make you feel relaxed. Shift your mindset from negative one to the positive one. For example, relax, relax, love, love. Or in Buddhism, I usually recommend. Practitioners to use the mantra Samma Arahang, which means the righteous path to purity. With this mantra, also help during meditation as well, when we have the wandering thoughts. Mantra or the uh, positive affirmation, it gradually change the quieter mind from the negative one to the positive one over time. So when we have that, it will let us out to be more at ease. And can replace the negative thoughts bit by bit, more and more, until you feel that your mind is getting calmer and more positive naturally. Strategies number three: practicing positive activity. This strategy will help you to distance from negative environment. It can be the outdoor activity, like walking in the nature, spend time with the nature. Such as in the park, in the garden, or during your vacation, spend time with that nature. That will help your mind to be gradually natural, relaxed, and peaceful. And that will allow your mind to turn from negative one to the positive one easily. Positive activity can be the way that you can clean your house, tidy your room. That will help yourself to stay with the cleaning, which is good for the mind to send some of cleanliness and the way you can feel positive during cleaning your house or your room. Other thing that you can stay with positive persons who can help you during the difficult times you have. This way, you will have some good guidance, good advice from them to lift up your life. To distance from the negative thoughts easily. Strategy number four: practicing meditation daily. With practicing of meditation, it's the best tool for the mind to be still and calm. And with the calm mind, will allow the mind to find in the peace, the positive energy from the stillness that will gradually change the quality of the mind from the negative one to the positive one. That we are able to enjoy peace and happiness within. And with regular practicing of meditation, you allow yourself to be happier. The mind becomes stronger, more positive enough for you to deal with the negative situation better. Or even you have the strength to avoid bad days, or anything may happen around you to make you feel down, but you are able to stay calm and be hopeful to make your life better. Strategy number five. Cultivating forgiveness and empathy. Forgiveness is a very good thing to practice because sometimes we do mistakes, or even someone make us feel bad and trouble us. But if we understand that everyone possible to do the bad thing, right? And because we are human being, we should forgive ourselves from the bad path we have done already. Don't let it come to your mind. And forgive yourself. And for those who may trouble you, give them a chance. Allow them to change themselves, or even learn from them 
with the empathy that everyone may take some time to understand them. And when we understand them, be able to let go of the negative thought that may have toward them. So if we practice forgiveness and empathy, it becomes a small space to do things correctly and able to stay with positive action we do. So with this technique, you're able to love yourself much more, love others much more as well. I hope five strategies to deal with your negative thoughts will help you to live happier and deal with your negative thoughts better as well. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day.